Yeah, she likes flying. But I don't know where she went. I don't know, Robin. But right now, it's time to go to bed. So, you can start looking for her tomorrow. Have you not read the papers today? No. President Jefferson has declared you a traitor. The Federals are after you. Tell no one I was here. Trumpets are over there. No, this isn't the eye doctor. It's just a job. You go home at the end of the day and you forget about it. I can't anymore. Well, you're gonna give yourself a heart attack. What would you do if nothing you did mattered? Every day was the same. Honestly, it is. I mean, I just go home, I got a few favorite moments. My evenings, weekends, snowmobiling. I wanna make things happen. I don't know what to tell you. I just wanna be responsible for my own successes and failures, you know? Well then sack up. What? Uh, I understand you're frustrated. I get it, I really do. Just give it a couple days. Matt, she's living with him? And she'll be 15 next month. Beth, I don't know. Things have changed. Daphne, I guess you could say, is no respecter of hypocrisy. <laughs> that sounds so honorable. What did you tell her? Nothing. She's a teenager and she was angry. She was poking around in places that she shouldn't have, found things that we saved from right after we got married. Party house, and pictures, all of us, all of it. So, juror number six said, in response to my question, what do you know about Act Bell Corporation? Quote, black people aren't a part of corporate America because that would be like being complicit with the enemy who is keeping black people in bondage. I think it's clear that he's not on our side. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Nomi, is that really how black people view corporate America? I assume that you're asking me that question because of my degree in African American studies, right? Point taken, Naomi. Point taken. Darn it! Gosh darn it! Hey, watch the cursing! <laughs> wow! Hey, Beth! So good to see you. Matt, this is Javier. Yeah, yeah, Javier. Christine's told me everything about you. Furniture guy. I'm really glad you could make it. Looks like you got something going on up there. You need some help? I mean, I really should have gotten the ladder, but I thought, okay, I could shove this pipe up from down here, but the thing is misshapen, and I've been trying to jam it into place, and, well, now it's getting dark. You know, you try to do it without the ladder. It takes you four times as long as we had the ladder. Okay, Beth. I totally approve. This guy knows just how it is. <laughs> <laughs> 